Hey guys, so uh, what's going on? We are back. Uh, as I, I don't know if I mentioned this in the startup of the last video, but uh, playing as the Cowboys now, played as Miami before. I accidentally deleted my, uh, all the videos for my Miami uh, account that I had going. Uh, as you can see, my overall nine, my overall rating is ninety one. Uh, all I did was upgrade my uh, my throwing. Uh, for medium, short, and long, that all I—that's literally all I upgraded. I have the XP uh, boosted a little bit from 100 to 200. So because uh, getting XP for stats on here is really hard, and I don't plan on playing the like 20 seasons of this just to max out my character, because by that time it it won't even I won't even be playing this game because the next one will be out. Um, I plan only playing a, like a couple of seasons. But uh, we're going to do the pre-seasons first. We got pre-season 1 to 4. Uh, this character is on its third year now. Uh, I send the first two. So we're going to be starting on its third year. And it's still a first string as you can see. Um, and uh, so yeah, we're going to get into it. Uh, I'm going to skip the uh, training parts. I'm just going to send the training stuff. Don't don't care about the training. Um, we're just going to get straight into the games. Uh, if if I need to get better at the game or anything or want to work on my playing, I will do that off video so you guys don't have to sit there and watch me mess up all the time. I just want you guys to watch me mess up uh, when I actually play. But uh, my goal has been since playing, uh, whenever I was playing, my other account is less interceptions. Because when I was first playing, I was throwing like four to six interceptions. And they were scoring like off three or four of those. And that's how they were keeping up with me most of the time. So if I throw no interceptions, like... Maybe try to keep it to one or, like, none. I, I won't have an issue at all unless we play, like, the Patri Patriots or something. Because w the only game that I lost last time, my season was, uh, it was 9-1. to one, And the only thing I lost was against Hello, the Patriots. Alright, Larry, we don't want to listen to you. But uh, I only lost against the Patriots, and that's because I threw two interceptions that they scored off of. But I only lost by, like, two or three points. So, uh, we're going to send fast. So, with the, uh, with the pre-seasons, I normally only play, like, a, like, throw a couple of times. Um, that's what it had me do last time, but I don't know if it'll be different. So, uh, we'll see. And, uh, if it is short, then I'll just put multiple pre-seasons into one video. But we'll just see as we go here. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Burton. And he's able to get it to the edge of the red zone at the 20-yard line. Seven yards to pick up on the pitch and catch. When you see zone defense, I don't know why my dude's bending over like he's tired already. Call. you got to be really careful as a passer about how far you let your guy go because he might wander into some tough coverage. They'll drop the throw. And this is caught at the 8. And they've got it in. I waited a little bit longer. He might have been able to run in. A solid pickup at 13 sets him up first and goal. I do believe we'll see a little bit more of this as this game progresses because when you can have that type of a game in the middle of the defense, it hurts him in so many ways because most Damn. escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Well, that was point counterpoint, wasn't it? They decided to throw for it on first and goal. Instead, the defense counters with pressure, and the defense wins, getting a big sack. Oh, that was easy. One thing I need to learn how to do is to cover and throw away on a blitz, because when they blitz me, I literally can't do anything, because there's like three or four of them on me instantly. And I need to work on throwing away the ball. Because when they run at me, sometimes I'll panic, and I'll just hit a button, and then that's, I think, how I intercept a lot, or I get intercepted. And when they want me to do those Hail Marys, I mess up a lot, too, because, like, I'll throw it, because I'm trying to lead them, like, you want to throw it in front of them, but then it falls back, and I don't know why, and then the dude behind them that's chasing them just looks behind them and just catches the ball, like, half the time. 
Y'all will probably see it like a couple of times if it does happen. But uh, with the Dallas, their offense is a lot better than the Miami was. Miami, I just had this uh, dude that was my... What is it called? The R, the RB, the the dude that stands behind you or whatever. I'm not good with like uh, football terms of words and stuff, and uh, that kind of stuff. But my uh, my receiver dude that stands next to me all the time. Um, oh, what am I doing? Um, shit, I don't even know what I'm doing. I fucked up. Oh no. Let's go. Alright, so that dude for the Miamis, like he he clutched up so many times. I don't know his name, but you can go in there and look at him. He's like the top player they have. He was like a ninety seven rating or something. But in this play, he had time in the pocket and waited for him to clear going across. I don't know why he rolled like that. I don't know what that was. A glitch or something? Damn, he went straight into a tackle. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. All right, I'm doing my rudimentary math here. That's his third catch here in the first quarter. I don't know if it's just game plan or he's just finding his way open. And maybe a little of both. And before they can run another play, the clock hits triple zero. Afternoon from the Meadowlands. Alright, so it looks like we lost that one. Wow, I didn't even throw most of the time. What the freak? Alright, so like I said, since this one was so short, I'm gonna do another pregame. Not gonna worry about upgrades right now. Advance week, next week. But I got the Madden going. Gonna try to go back and record some MLB. When I was in Alabama, before I left, I played like a lot of it and kind of like burnt myself out on it a little bit. But I'm gonna have to go back to it and start getting myself back into it a little bit more. Um, cause my MLB career is already like seven or eight years through and I only send two of those. And, uh, and when you play MLB, you play a lot more games than you do football and they can last a lot longer. Uh, because for me, my, my baseball player, he hits and, uh, throws because, uh, I've kind of like, I mainly focus on his, uh, pitching first, like hardcore. And then I started working on his batting skills and stuff. And, uh, he's, I think he's made, like, 20 or 30 home runs so far, like, overall, which is not a lot compared to most hitters, but, I mean, he's a pitcher, which is God's status, like, if you think about it. Alright, so, we skipped the first week, what? Alright, I think we accidentally skipped the, uh, second week, so we're just gonna play the third week. Whoops. Well, the overall Dallas, Dallas Cowboys rating is 82. What? Oh, well. Whatever.
Alright, this loading is taking a while. Hello everyone, I'm Larry Ridley. You're tuned in to the Sorry, I'm reading articles on the news for today. And the quarterback won't Crazy the stuff that's going on in Texas right now. Our prayers and everything go out for them. Now the first carry for Ezekiel oh, that was bad. And this one goes nowhere. Losing yardage back at the 22. The loss of a All right, so here, here we go. This, this is what down. I was talking about earlier. I hate, or well, actually not this. This is not really a, a Hail Mary. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. Throw left side complete. It's Dixon. That one goes for 24 yards. That's a matchup. Maybe they go back to their outer third of the field as this game continues. Yeah, I think back to my high school coach, John Ford, he used to say when we got big plays early in a oh, game or good plays, oh, they say, follow it away, lad. Follow it away because he'd want to come back to it later in a key situation. Oh, no. What? Come back to this one a little more often than that. Didn't he say laddie or did he say lad? Yeah, it just depends on what he was feeling in the moment. Okay. I thought, I thought that was the guy you told me about these say laddie a lot. Laddie? When you heard laddie, he was usually in a pretty good mood. Lad? Yeah. He'll try again with the arm here on second down. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. It's a gain of 11 yards that time, and it produces a new set of downs. When you run a screen pass really well, you got to like the look of it because so many parts come together to make it work well. The offensive linemen, where they're faking people out, the back slipping out there, catching the football, they all been going together as one unit downfield. A really nice pickup. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. Back to back 11. Damn, dude. Games. That means I got to get used to plays down. from Dallas nice all over. Yeah, I, I like some of the plays for Miami because I got used to them. That don't often get picked up in coverage easily. And I'm talking about me that use the backs out of the backfield. Because I know that when I used to cover, hey, we got everybody cut. Oh, he just snuck out there. And they just got a nice first down there. What do we love to say? Get those backs into space, right? And they were able to do that there. Nice pickup on first down. They'll look to throw. Going right side here, and that's complete. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. Give him 11 yards that time and a new set of downs. Here we go now. 3, 19. Inside the red zone here. They'll look to throw. Oh, that was stupid. I hate that play so much. Losing yardage back at the 22. Uh, he lost six there on the first down play. Let's go. Off the play fake. He'll look to throw. Get it. Easy. Easy. Touchdown. Now, this is what I'm talking about. I'll probably go for the right bumper or the X. I, I hate going for B when it's stuff like this. Oh, get it, boy. 
Inside the 30. Touchdown. That's what I'm talking about. the Cowboys. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. Wide open receiver. Oh, if he could have made that. If he could have kept going, I swear. It would have been over. Coming up at halftime in a little less than two minutes, we'll send you to Orlando where Larry Ridley is standing by. He'll have highlights and analysis of this first half. And for a right side here, complete. And he's brought down. Give him 12 yards on that one. It earns him a fresh set of downs. They'll look to throw here on first down. Throwing right in that Oh, yeah, boy. A good pick up there at 22. Dude, I'm doing a lot better than I was before. Oh, no. Yards here in the first half. Boy, a tough start for the secondary defensively. It is, and it's got to put a dent in their confidence. And, you know, you always want to keep that up and feel like you can always bounce back after plays. Oh, yes, A. Oh, what, is, what kind of, what is that? How can you go under at someone like that? And how can they play better? There's no way you're allowed to do shit like that. It's fucking stupid. Second and ten. And he comes that was bad. With one complete. That catch good for five. It's third down. And on third down, a nickel formation here defensively. We better do this, boy. Hey, 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 hey. They'll run it now. Out yeah. They all hit each other and, and fell down. I definitely like the play call. You don't expect it on third and five. Look at that. Six, do you? you expect a pass play. Had a little curve. I'm just like, what the heck? Run, boy, they were successful. The hell, Mary. What the fuck is this? All right, here we go. They'll set up to throw. See, oh, it's incomplete. That what is been that? Big in the end zone if he could have held on. Instead, it's second down. You know, last week I remember asking you what would an offensive coordinator be looking for week two of the preseason. Now we're in week three. Defensive coordinator wise, what's he looking at? For the most part in preseason. Yeah, boys. Touchdown, Cowboys. Fuck with me. And while that touchdown does not get the Now come the Cowboys now as he'll go on off. First here in this third quarter. They have the lead now. They'll be looking to extend that lead. And this is where I enjoy talking about one of my favorite subjects. Tendency breakers. Oh, oh yes. He, oh, if he could have made it off that dude. Oh, that was a touchdown. That would have been a touchdown. To see what you've done, they're going to make their adjustments. So guess what? You adjust yourself and try and stay ahead of the pace because you are looking for some separation in this ball game. The adjustment to the adjustment. Without a doubt. <laughs> show him one thing, hit him with something else. Looking to throw. And yeah, quick throw here, that's complete. Nice. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. That one goes for 13 yards, and it moves the sticks. His big game continues. Already has the three touchdown grabs, tacking on some more yardage and a first down. And how precise has his route running been in this game? We just saw him get open yet again. He's also made adjustments as the defense has tried to really stop. Oh, dang, dude. Down. They get 10 more there, and I believe that'll be enough for another first down. It will. And that last reception puts him over 150 yards now on the game, Charles. And now it's not just execution. It's not just performance. It's a mental aspect that's going on. Because right now, he's got the defense so much on their heels. Got them looking at each other. Who's going to cover this guy? And what kind mm, of covers that's a loss, out there I think. Try and slow him down. Yeah, give him four yards no, there. Four. It'll be second and six. I'd say they've got to find a way to get him going. He's such a big part of their offense. I wonder if they might throw it a little. 
and come back to the run. Anything because you're right, he's pretty much been completely neutralized. He'll look to throw. It's a short one here, complete to his tight end. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. Eight yards on the pick up there, and it moves the sticks. First down and 10 Yeah, they're right. The We're going to come back group. to the run. I'm going to wake this dude up. Now yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking Open about. Space inside the 10. Oh. Missed. Missed. This will not go down. So after that big gain, let's see what else the offense has up in going for that Y. Oh, that A, though. A, A, A. It's A. It's A. Yeah, it is A. This is caught for a Cowboy touchdown. A good, sustained drive there. And then Dallas gets sent to take the field. They'll come out throwing here on first down. Over the middle complete. It's Burton. And they'll take him down at the 31-yard line. A gain of six there on first. He's playing a good game right now. All right, that's fine. That's fine. It's just a different play. Oh, no. No, they ain't having me play anymore. Damn it, dude. Hey, at least we won that one. Play of this game, they knew that they needed some.